Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome everyone back to another AW Advanced Warfare video and as you can see in today's video We're gonna be looking at is another elite weapon video you guys do love these if you want more Be sure to smash that like button down below that would be cool Unfortunately, I could not make a video yesterday just because I've got some schoolwork But my exams are almost over so I should be able to be pumping you guys videos out every single day Consistently maybe even double uploading if that's possible But getting back to the video as you guys have probably already seen by the thumb now and title we're going to be looking at is another elite video and basically in today's video what I decided to do was show you guys what I think personally if you're going to open up a supply drop what is the top five best royalty elite weapons you can get once again this is my honest opinion or my own opinion of what I think you guys can have your own opinion which is fine uh, but some people do get mad especially when I don't put their favorite weapon on the list I'm really really sorry for that uh, but this is my own opinion of what I think what I want you guys to do in the comment section down below is let me know out of all the royalty elite weapons which one would you get or you can name me your top five royalty elite weapons that you would like to get in a supply drop and that's exactly what I'm going to be showing you guys in today's video so the first weapon I would love to get in a supply drop which is what I'm fortunately enough to have is the bow 27 royalty and basically this bow 27 royalty is the same as an inferno and with all royalty elite weapons basically what happens is they copy it off a original elite weapon stat so unfortunately there's no stat upgrades or anything along those lines and with the bow 27 royalty this is basically the inferno as you can see it's got the plus one fire rate the plus two handling and the mobility is going down by three I used this in a live video and what I've got to say this thing shoots really fast so if you like the normal obsidian steed or the normal bow and if you don't think it shoots or kills anyone fast enough this weapon's gonna blow you away and trust me you definitely need extended mags and what I'm gonna say definitely that is one of the best weapons and also that purple camo looks so good I can't explain how good it looks in words that'd be cool if you could put like a diamond camo over it I think that'd look even more insane but the next weapon we're going to be looking at is the ASM1 royalty uh, this is actually the speakeasy version so it's got the damage going down by one the fire rate going up by two but the range going down by one and we're going to say this weapon is also insane and just like the speakeasy because how fast it shoots it's like they're adding in the best variants to some of these weapons and some weapons weapons uh, that they added in they didn't put the best variant to it which is actually quite unfortunate so as you can see it's got the plus two fire rate it's got the nice purple camo and what's pretty cool about the royalty elites uh, is that obviously they don't have any stat increases but I'm almost definitely sure they give you like an extra mag or some extra bullets which isn't too bad but for a royalty elite you would be expecting a lot better but so far I gotta say if I were to get that thing I'd probably scream my lungs off the next weapon I'm going to be looking at on my list has got to be the Moors Royalty. This is basically the reskin of the Moors Doctor. And yes, the Doctor is such a good weapon. So this has got a the fire rate going up by 2, the accuracy going down by 1, the damage going down by 1, the handling going up by 1, and the mobility going down by 1. So even though the damage isn't going up or down, the damage going up just makes uh, wall banging with this weapon better. Uh, but the thing we're looking at is the fire rate because when it comes down to quick scoping, fire rate is everything. And when it comes down to the Doctor, I love it. Unlike the more silver bullet, that thing shoots a little bit too slow and also when you reload it. And I personally prefer the Doctor, which is the Moors royalty. And as you can tell, yes, this thing has got a banging camo. If only the silver bullet had it, because the silver bullet's got a nice camo itself. And if they smash this purple camo on top of it, I think it would look quite nice. The next weapon is got to be the Sack 3 royalty boom. Yes, this weapon looks quite nice. It's got the three plus damage which makes this weapon insane this is actually the normal one-handed sack version and there isn't any other sack one-handed version well there is another elite version but I think that one is different to this one so it's got plus three damage and the handling is going down by three I gotta say this is my favorite submachine gun out of the game as well as the speakeasy this thing is insane I want to get it really badly because it is one-handed and I gotta say it looks pretty insane so if you're gonna open any supply drops this has got to be one of the best stuff that you want the last weapon we're going to be looking at on my list has got to be the M1 Irons. As you can see, this is actually a elite uh, remake of another version. I can't exactly remember what it's called, uh, but as you can see, the damage is going down by one, the accuracy is going up by one, the fire rate's going down by one, the range is going up by one, the handling's going up by one, and the mobility is going down by one. I actually have the other elite version of this, and it's quite good because at long range, this weapon is insane, and that's exactly what I like to use this weapon at. It's good at close range already, even though these stats are going down and up, down and up.
coming up. It is still good at close range as well as long range, which I absolutely love. And that's basically my list when it comes down to my top five royalty elite weapons. Let me know out of all of these, which one would you get? I definitely want the SAC uh, 1.5 royalty. That thing looks insane. I do want it. So guys, if you have enjoyed, I like much appreciate it. Let's see if it's smash over 300 likes on today's video. Hopefully you've all enjoyed and I will catch you guys later. Globe out.